I felt like it was possible, but probably more likely not going to happen. And I was okay with that. Um, uh, and, and so I just genuinely like, wasn't expecting it to go that way. Um, uh, and so, so I think that is what's shocking about it. Um, but also just trying to wrap my mind around it. Um, you know, being that the Academy Awards, like for so many people was always sort of a beacon of, you know, uh, achievement of, if you know, I, I, moments growing up, watching the Oscars, um, having, like, remembering Halle Berry winning her Oscar and Julia Roberts winning her Oscar and those moments kind of being indelible in my mind. Um, and me dreaming that one day, you know, I, I m might get to be in that room. Um, it's just all so surreal. And I feel like I'm in a little bit of a time warp at the moment of being 10 year old and 16 year old America and just kind of what this moment means to, to them. I think particularly for people who grow up aspiring to, to be artists and who are so deeply inspired by the work that is seen and acknowledged in those rooms and inspired by the artists in those rooms to, to, you know, my dream as a child of, of getting to build a life, doing what I love to do was, was, was so far-fetched and so improbable based on the evidence of of you know what what seemed likely for for someone like me and the fact that I have built a career and a life getting to do what I love to do is still in some ways surreal to me on a daily basis and so to get to experience this acknowledgement from people who I so deeply admire um it, it it's it feels wonderful and great um and also just so surreal and and i'm also just proud of myself for not 